Okay, so what the divine source wants us to know. The divine source wants us to know that for those that are stuck on a specific person. Yeah, just, just focus on yourself. Focus on yourself. Give yourself that love and nurturing that you need. And know that if something's meant to be, it will be. Don't force it. Don't focus on another person besides yourself. Just just know. Just know. Um, everything is coming out better than you can imagine. So just continue to focus on self and just know that everything is working out for your highest good. You you have so much going on in your life and what, what we want to do is focus on um, expansion and, and growth and so we want to not be distracted on the outside because the dis the the outside distractions will distract you if you allow it to. So don't don't get distracted. Don't get distracted by anything from the outside. Um, again, nourish nourish yourself. Continue to nourish yourself and and um, really go within and, and know who you are. Know who you are. Nour nourish the inner self. Heal yourself nourish yourself give yourself that love that you need let go of anything that is weighing heavy on you whether that's a person place or thing or even your own thoughts let it go don't don't keep focus on it um again some of you might be having inner conflict that n needs um a resolution to it and again just don't give it so much focus. It's like really hot here. Um, don't give it so much focus. Just continue to focus on thyself. Because you are receiving a breakthrough. You are receiving a breakthrough. You gotta believe in yourself. You have to believe in yourself. And just know that um, if someone isn't treating you the way you know you deserve to be treated... Just, just focus on yourself and give it to yourself. Don't, don't focus on someone else giving that to you. You know what I mean? Really, like, take yourself out. Love yourself. Just really, really give it to yourself. Is it, you know, and then you'll start to see a beautiful, um, a beautiful you come out of that, that seed. You know, that beautiful energy that you know you, you hold from within. And just focus on that that beautiful energy that you want to throw out, and you you'll start to truly get it. Um, face your fears. I, I think that the main focus right here is just not focusing on anyone else other than yourself right now, um, because a lot of people are going through some sort of uh, conflict or issues when it comes to another person, but just. Keep your focus on you. Take yourself out. Love on yourself. Um, love over fear, you know. Um, uh, face your fears. You don't want to be alone. You you don't want, um, you know, but, uh, you know, they say you're never alone unless you abandon yourself. So just, just, just give yourself that what you need and, and deserve and. Uh, if someone aligns with you or with your energy and stuff, then it'll, it'll all come together. Yes. Self-love, self-worth, you know, giving yourself that self-respect, know your value, give it to you. You know, you know what you, you deserve. You know your worth. You know the kind of love you're wanting. Um, surrender to receive. So right now I would say surrender wanting something on the outside of you. Surrender. Surrender wanting something on the outside. Just go within and focus on on you. Even yes, this topic is basically about focusing on you because um, 
the distraction the distractions from the outside has really got some people right now you are what you think so uh, if you want better thoughts then continue to uh, change your thoughts change them into better thought thinking and um, create better emotions you know because your your mind and your emotions needs to be mastered I want better things in my life and so I'm going to think better things and uh, uh, reprogram myself because we've all been uh, programmed and so um, all this uh, negativity and, and uh, lack is from a program that someone else has programmed within us um, from the things that we've observed and and um, and witnessed in, in our lives but we have to tell ourselves a new story you know don't don't keep going back to the old story tell yourself a new story uh, because it's all just a perception it's all oh um, it's all it's like how you perceive it each person is going to perceive it differently uh, depending on the situation um, so um, if it's just all of a perception then change how you're seeing it change how you're seeing it um, and tell you just like I said tell yourself a new story uh, focus on the bigger picture what's what's most important to you in your life What's most important to you in your life? Is it you, your family, your children, your work? What is it that's the most important? And um, God, of course, and uh, just focus on that. Like for me, I've just been telling myself, I just want my focus to be on God. I'm just like keeping out all distractions. Where does God, where does my God want me to be at in life? And um, just focusing on, on on me, not no one else. And so that's where I'm at in my life. Um, your best investment is in self. And so um, once you realize that, you'll start to take out all the other distractions and really focus on self and what it is that you need to do to, to grow and to prosper and to become abundant because you hold the key within yourself. So just, just know that you have all the tools and, and skills from within. Um, all your prayers are being answered. So continue to pray. Continue to know that the universe is listening, divine source. And when you pray, something magical happens and, and you, you know, everything's being answered. Everything's being answered. So just be patient and, uh, continue to give gratitude. Gratitude is very important. Um, you're a master manifester. You're a master manifester. Um, anything that you say will happen. So that's why we have to be mindful of what we're telling ourselves. That's why I said, tell yourself a new story. If the old story isn't working anymore, and if it's um, continuing to like weigh down and weigh heavy on you, then start to tell yourself a new story here. You're a master manifester here. So tell yourself all the great things you know you are, and you'll start to see it. You'll start to believe it, and you'll start to see it. Getting out of your head, a lot of people are overthinking. Um, so just get out of your head, um, create better thoughts, you know, because those <clears throat> negative thoughts and not just negative thoughts, but just overthinking will, will can weigh down on you as well. So get out of your head and just just breathe, breathe and 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 uh, do a meditation to where you just clear your mind. And so that way, the thoughts don't weigh heavy on you. Victory is yours. You do this and, 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 and you start to master yourself and you get to know thyself. And so you, you become victorious. You become victorious in this. And you start to receive gifts. You have gifts. You have plenty of gifts. Spiritual gifts, uh, physical gifts, um, abundant, uh, 
plenty of abundant gifts. And so when you start to um, start to focusing more on self instead of outside distractions, you, you become victorious and you start to receive so much more. I love you all and I hope that you all have an amazing and wonderful day. Mwah.